Hey guys, I'm Ken Domic from KBD Productions TV. I was asked by a subscriber of mine how I put a watermark in my videos. And a watermark is an identification mark, just like I have here at the bottom left part of my screen or of my video. And my watermark is basically my channel name, KBD Productions TV. So this is a quick tutorial in Final Cut Pro 6. Uh, it'll pretty much work the same in, I think, all the the Final Cut Pros, I think even 10. Uh, basically, if you're just going to put a word there like I do, uh, you just go to Effects, grab your title, drag it down like I did here, double click it, uh, click Controls, click Title 3D, it'll come up here, you type your name, make sure you put uh, a little bit of a, an outline on your white letters and a bit of a drop shadow, it really helps make sure people see that. Uh, hit apply, it'll come up. I drag my opacity or my um, transparency bar to around 38. That seems to work pretty good. It's not in people's faces too much. You don't want to have it like a full on big logo in people's faces. They don't want to see that for 15 minute video. So again, you can have that or you can also bring in um, a graphic if your company logo is a graphic or your company graphic or logo is your graphic for your watermark so you would just uh, Apple I or command I uh, and then grab a PNG PNGs are the best things to grab and put into a timeline so you drag that over top of your video click over top of it so you can see it highlight it then you can spin it and I just grabbed the corner. You could see when it showed you that little swivel thing. Uh, wait for it to stop. Drag it down to the size you want. It's always best to bring things in at the size you want. Uh, that way it's less confusing for the computer to have to deal with. You don't want to bring in something that's huge and then make it small. Just bring it in small. Um, and then uh, you would just dra drag your opacity bar or your transparency bar down to let's say 30 let's do 50 or 46 there you go and there's your logo in the bottom if that was a logo obviously it's not it's an arrow so there you go guys there's a quick tutorial on how to put a watermark in your videos uh, i suggest you do that that way when people try to steal your videos and put it up on their channel they can't or it makes it at least a little bit harder for them to uh, steal your video and when people are watching your video they can see right away that it's your video uh, i know in youtube that you can see at the top but it's kind of cool and uh yeah like it's cool talk to you later guys bye